I'm checking in on my worm cafe to see how my COVID haircut uh, hair clippings are doing. I've already fluffed up this side of the bin and seen that they've pretty much worked through everything except the year old Swiss chard stalks. They're softening up, but they're not uh, done yet, as well as, um, you know, about a two inch segment of asparagus stalk that was similarly very woody. Otherwise, they seem to be out of food. And so let's see if they got around to eating my COVID haircut. Again, my apologies for the shaky video. I am trying to balance as best as I can while I do this. Okay, I see a bit of hair on the surface. I'm not expecting that to be uh, worked over by the worms because it wasn't in touch with the, the microbes in the uh, castings. And as I pull it, I still see hair. So I'm pulling it up. It's coming up in a in a solid mass again. Uh, gosh, this is taking a long time, but I do see I do see a worm in there. So there's there's somebody interested. Oh, and he's kind of he's kind of hanging down there. He's clinging on to something in there. So that's encouraging that we've got at least one worm interested. I think there's more hair over in this corner. Let's check. And there are worms under the hair. There, there's worms. The hair feels just like hair. It just hasn't lost any of its structural in integrity. It's very matted. I've tried teasing it apart so that it's in smaller bits for the worms. You know, I'm not really in a panic. I'd, I'd like to run this experiment through to see them digest it completely rather than me, you know, take my clippers out here and cut it into smaller segments. So. As you can see, the level in the bin is dropping. So, um, and I do want to groom this bin for harvest. So I don't really want to add a lot more bedding to it. So I'm going to dig a, dig a trench, a bit of a deeper trench to get, um, to get uh, these worms more, like I said, the hair more in touch with the existing castings down the bottom here. I'll try to put the hair as deep as I can. I'm operating this segment of the Worm Cafe um, on its own piece of cardboard rather than as part of the tower system. Uh, long story short, it's just easier for me to access uh, these bins. Sorry about my arm in the way there easier for me to access these bins because I am in a wheelchair um, if they each have their separate entrance so to speak and so by having this one up on a piece of cardboard I can get to it a lot easier than if they're always in the tower setup um, it's doing fine it's been like this for probably a month now so there goes the hair into the trench Goodbye, COVID haircut. Into the trench it goes. There, there goes the hair. Let's see if the worms will find it again. I'm sure they would. Will. There's, there they are, nice healthy red whippler. You can go find the worm. Or go find the hair. And like I said, I'd, oh. See, and I always end up with hair on the surface after I dig my trench. I always, that's why I'm never going to get to it if it's on the surface. Let me check again. There's another little piece. And I might as well bury uh, this bit of avocado and this little bit of, actually I think that's the old end of the roots off the, the leek that I put in here. Quite a while ago, I think that was, a, that was the tail end of the, the leak that we pulled.
pulled from the garden. Yeah, a few sprouts, but they will get to those in good. Oh, and look at that, another bit of hair on the surface. Like I said, I did cut a lot of hair off. So into the trench you go. And another bit of hair on the surface. Into the trench you go. Let me just do another pull back a little bit. I'll try to hold the camera steady. Mm, I'm going to find a strawberry. Somebody must have been eating strawberries and just thrown a strawberry end in here without freezing it. That'll be fine. Mm, any more hair? Not big amounts. Let me just push the castings over. These, <laughs> interestingly, these are um, date sprouts. That is a uh, pit. Uh, we had some dates. They still had pits in them and a couple of them have sprouted. So interesting. Anyway, take care everyone. Hope this, uh, hope this informed you about hair composting. <laughs>